Sutures are actually a type of a joint because it is a place where two bones are meeting. This is a suture. That's a suture. Any little line where there's two bones stitched together, that's a suture. So every time you cross a suture, you're in a new bone. I'm sure every single one of them has a name. I do not know every single name. I'm just going to go over the main ones that are covered in a standard basic anatomy class. So this one here that runs across the crown of your head, that is the coronal suture and it is separating the frontal bone from the parietal bones. Then running straight down the center of your head is the sagittal suture that is separating the two parietal bones. Then in the back here, that is the lambdoid suture. So that is separating the parietal bones from the occipital bone. And it is the lambdoid suture because of the shape of it. So lambda is a Greek letter Oid means looks like. It's the lambdoid suture because they're trying to say that it resembles the Greek letter lambda. And then if we look here, this suture separating the parietal from the temporal bone, that's the squamous suture. So remember squamous cells, squamous cells are flat. It's like a flat little suture. All right, so that's all I have to say about sutures. Hope this was helpful. Have a great day and have fun learning.